have your science buzz, a preview of some of the attractions that are out of this world coming up this week. You know, Tuesday, NASA plans to release the first high resolution photos taken by the James Webb Tape Space Telescope. This is the most powerful, complex telescope ever built, and at least one of the 72 pictures taken will be the deepest image of our universe that we've ever seen before. NASA is also sharing photos from a nebula, which is 7600 light years away and made up of stars much bigger than our sun. That'll be really exciting. They've been working on that since the 90s. All right, dinosaur fans, grab your pocketbooks or maybe you might need uh, everybody else's pocketbook. Look at this, a rare archaeological find heading to the auction blocks in New York. Sotheby's announced it will be selling a fossilized skeleton of a gorgeous saurus. It is a relative of the T-Rex and this unique auction is going to be so special because it's the only specimen available for private ownership. Sotheby's expects it expects to sell for five to eight million dollars. All right, animals in a Japanese aquarium are being fed cheaper fish and they really aren't very happy about it. The struggling economy, yes, it's impacting us all and it has led the aquarium to doing what it can to cut their costs. The penguins and other animals typically eat fish called aji, but that price has spiked 30% over the last year. So they tried switching to a cheaper alterna alternative, the saba or mackerel, but it wasn't received very well. Those animals kind of were seen swatting away, saying, no, I I'm not interested in that. So they've come to a kind of agreement. They've mixed the mackerel with the aji, and so far, the animals are tolerating it. That's kind of just a, a funny one to see the animals there. And, you know, we